sitting there looking at me. You're there. Hey, y'all. Yeah, oh. no, hey, there you're, we are. You're good. You're going. Jane says it's four o'clock. That's right. <laughs> are y'all there? Hey, y'all. Four o'clock. We're live. Yeah. Hiawassee, Georgia. We're going to teach you how to do a stencil today. And? And trowel some metallic paint. Right. We're going to trowel right. it. Go, you go, girl. Okay. All right. We're just going to show y'all part of it. Show them your stuff. Show them your stuff. What stuff? Your stuff. Oh, yeah. See? Isn't that pretty? Now, that's done with paint and a trowel. But we're not going to show you the bottom until later. Yeah, okay? there's more. There's more behind door yeah. number one. Yeah. See, there's that's the secret door. That's the green door. Yeah. So... I'm gonna lay this over here. I just found the little rubber thing that goes to your pig. I'm gonna put it in a safe place where we can get it on your, where it belongs. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, these are just styrene boards. Uh, we used to use these whenever we were doing samples for faux finishing, and they really come in handy whenever you wanna do a sample for someone, so. Uh, and Jane, I think you're gonna get some of these so that you can teach finishes. I sure this am. Well. Mm -hmm. My friend Renee brought me two or three from Arkansas. So, because this finish here would be absolutely gorgeous in a powder bath bedroom. Be very pretty. And all this is, is uh, you can use any primer on these, but I use Miss Lillian's Swamp Mud. So, um, I just put one coat on there and I just rolled it on. It doesn't have to be perfect, but I want when I trowel the paint on, we're going to leave some of that black showing through. They can't see you. Yeah, they can. I'm right there. Oh yeah, there you are. Okay. Yeah, they can see. And we are going to be using Miss Lillian's uh, watermark silk. Hey Deb, you did make it. Like hey that Nancy, right can that's right. Here we go. Show time. Yeah. And then Miss Lillian's Shimmering Luster, which is the uh, caramel color. There's a little bit of a glare on that. So. So here we go. Here we go. Hey, Marie Rose. Just wanted to check and see who was that. I saw you flash up there, but I didn't catch it before you went off my screen. All right. I knew I should have opened that before. Well, a good whack on the head always <laughs> does them good. It does, doesn't Straighten it? Straighten them right up. <laughs> Ooh, doesn't that look good? Yes. Those very are beautiful. Pretty. Watermark colors. silk and shimmering luster, which is kind of a stain or a top coat. You can put it on the top of a finish. Hope y'all can see that. Can they see the top? Can you see y'all? Tell me. Talk to me. Tell me. Can you see it? You know what? Drop okay. my... That's when you don't turn your notifications off. Mine aren't off either, by the way. That's good. There you go. That's good. I don't care right. what they see me or not. No. It's, no, it's important that they see what we're trying to show That's them. That's right. That's right. And and these... Hey, April Vaughn. We'll be, uh, we can get these. They are called Japan Scrapers, like that right there. We'll be carrying those. They are from... Um, Artistic studio, Jennifer Ferguson, but Jane and I will be carrying them. And um, then the trowels. And the trowels are, you have to really be careful because the edges are very, very sharp. So whenever you wash them, you want to be very careful and use something and just, you don't want your fingers to go up against that because I have been in the emergency it's sharp. room. <laughs> it's sharp, metal will yes. that's why. So you don't want to do that. And you just take your Japan scraper, run it on the edge like that. We're going to do it this way so that y'all can see it better. Okay. Put it on the edge like that. And then you just bring it down. And you don't have to, like you want to leave open spots like that right there. And there's no perfection about this at all. That's why I like it so much. <laughs> I like imperfections. Yes. It makes things a little bit easier that way. Yes. If I want to go back up, then I can do that right there. There. And then I'm going to come from better. the bottom up. Yours must be okay. And you can also go sideways. See, that doesn't it doesn't matter. That's another thing I like. You don't have to color in the lines. Yes, no. Okay, I'll go ahead and do it. 
another. See, and I'm not putting any pressure on the trowel at all. I'm almost just kind of floating and I'm not letting this all the way down. I'm just tipping that edge right there. And if I have a line, I just come back up. See, it just eliminates it. You can go sideways to blend that in. The thing is to not be afraid of it and just jump right in and do it. Just do yeah. it. Like right? Nike. Just do it. Just do it. That's what Jane says. I don't have my I don't have my person. Hey girls, hey from South Africa, you're back. Lori <laughs> Stevens keeps calling. Um, <laughs> Obviously, she's not watching our Facebook no. <laughs> Live. Can y'all see that okay? These are really a lot of fun. And also, uh, another thing that you can do if you want, you wanted to add a little interest to it, you can put your trowel down on it and pull up and... It makes a print of the trowel. Yeah. Can you hold that up there? I sure can. see that? Sure. It kind of lifts up a little Let's bit. See if I can show you. See how it does that? Yeah. Nate, you see that? Right there, kind of on that. It's right, right in there. Right in there. Like that. Now, let me go over here and give y'all a turn. I think that's pretty cool. There's just a lot of different things and techniques okay. that you can do. Yes. And there even are. though I've put that there, it's okay. I come back and I just barely touch it and it's gone. It's, it's fine. Are, are you going to come? I'm gonna are you going to moderate or just eat? Okay, great. Here comes my moderator. Can't do without a moderator. It's like he's going to the movies. He's got Coke, yeah. um, goldfish. I'm, I'm entertained. It's like he's um, yeah, it's like he's at the movies. He's got his <laughs> snacks. He's ready to watch the show. Hi girls. Love the texture. Thank you. Yes, we do too. It's gonna get even more texture. You just watch and see. Yeah. We've only just begun with the texture. But the real kicker is tomorrow. <laughs> We're yep, not going to tell them, though. Yeah, tomorrow's going to be fun. That's the paint sprayer, y'all. Tomorrow's the paint sprayer. You see how I'm just kind of going over that away? And I'm going to finish with this, and then I'm going to add <clears throat> the other color. I was wondering about caramel. that. Caramel. Okay. You know what you all there now? I've, I think I've pretty well spoken to everyone so far. I'm sitting here eating snacks, too. Deb uh, Keyshaw is eating her snacks, too. Okay. Get just a little bit more. And it doesn't matter how many times you do this. There, You are never going to have two that are alike. They always be different. And if you are going to do like a powder room or something like that, it would be best to finish the room, which a powder room, you could do that in a day without any problems because your hand will kind of change from day to day. I know that sounds crazy, but it does. All right. Now we're going to add the... The, the caramel. caramel. And now this, I'm just, this is just going to be the accent color. We just want to not really add in near as much. We just, and I am literally just barely touching. And y'all can kind of see that's all the product that I'm putting on there. See that? Just a teeny weeny bit. Oh, let me move it. There it goes. See there? Just a teeny weeny bit. Yep. Here, let me see. You got somebody up here that's saying something. What are you making and when are you painting on? Glenda Cusimano, what are you making and what are you painting on? Those are metallic um, paints from Miss Lillian's. One yes. is called Watermark Silk and the other is called Caramel. Um, they're... they're um, 
Actually, the caramel is more like, it's called a luster. You can use it like a glaze or a stain. Mm -hmm. so or a top here, coat. Or fact. a top coat even. This is what we're using today. And I'm putting it on a styrene board. This is what I used to use whenever. This is going to be upside down, but if I turn it up, the paint's going to run out. So, yeah. anyway, because the lid isn't on it. When I used to do samples for clients for faux finishing, it's what I used. And see, I've just barely hit that. And I'm, I am literally just barely touching that, as you can, just like that, just very soft. Light-handedly. Very. Okay. I'm going to add a little bit of texture, and I'm just going to go in like that. And then I can come back and come down if I don't like it. Because in this, this is perfectly imperfect. Okay. There are no mistakes. There's nothing that cannot be fixed. If you don't like it, you can just scrape it off and start over. All right. Yep, should I should take this off, shouldn't I? Oh, I don't. Let's do it. Okay. So they can kind of see. All right. The now, tape sort of makes a nice frame, so yeah. it is nice to do. Take the tape off. And before um, I started doing this, I had used a primer, which you can use any primer. But uh, I used Miss Lillian's products, so I just used the uh, Swamp Mud, which was black. Okay, there you go. Okay, here we go. So here's fa here's part one. Part one. Uh, hey, Kenise. This is part one. You would let that dry overnight. Here we go. Part one. Part one. All right. Because you're on a delay, I, I get to see them first. Because it's my live feed. You got to wait for it to get to you. Okay. All right. All right. Should we cover that up? No. We'll let them see. Okay. This is what we're going to show you here. Once that's dry, what, the uh, stencil come from Jennifer Ferguson Artistic Painting Studio. And uh, Jane will have these for sale in her store. Yep, it, it will. Thank you for the heart. It will be pretty. We just started it, so. We just kind of wanted, so it wouldn't take so long, because sometimes it might take longer than what everybody wanted to kind of hang around for. I don't know if y'all want to watch us do this whole stencil. The whole thing. And it's very easy to match back up. You just have to fit the pattern back in. I think that looks pretty good. You got yours? I don't think no. Okay. That looks perfect. Now, perfect. does it look perfect over where you are? By all means. Okay. okay. Now, we're just typing this down, but if you're doing a large area, um, which I don't, I don't know if Jennifer Ferguson carries this or not. I'll have, we need to ask her that. Yeah, a spray? I don't, know. I don't know if she has a spray. I know she okay. uses spray, but I don't know if she has a spray. But you can use any know. stencil adhesive spray, and you don't want to use a lot. You want to hold your stencil, you know, about 6 to 12 inches from you and just start at the top and go down very even like that. But we're not going to use it on this. Yeah, here Charles said she joined Jennifer's creative group. Jennifer Weber? You did? Yay! Well, we're in the so, Yes! So look for us. Most of the stuff Jennifer does live, I have to catch later because by the time I do my lives and run my business and do my post and Marie Rose said, everything. Marie Rose said, love the stencil. Marie, Thank Marie you. Williams. Awesome. Yeah. Yeah, it's very pretty. It's She's got pretty some stencil. very gorgeous ones. Do we want to turn our stencil? That's yeah, true. so they can see. Yes. And for these, we're using the metallic colors burgundy of Miss Lillian's and the sable metallic. Okay. And I'm the sable. I'm, yeah. I'm on the sable 
She's on the sable. I'm on the sable brush. She's on the uh, <laughs> burgundy. The burgundy brush. You know, it's kind of like people being on the flute or the trombone. I'm on the sable brush. <laughs> and the thing about stenciling is you just dip it in there, but your offload is very important. You do not want very much paint on your stencil brush. See, all that has just about come off. And then I'm going to start, and then Jane is going to come in behind me with her color. And then I, and you always want to start out here on the edge and go into your open area. Whenever I'm, you I'm bringing start. up the rear. Yeah. That's what but, I'm doing. But then I come back in after you, huh? Yep, you do. She cleans up whatever I haven't done right. <laughs> That's not true. <laughs> 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 if y'all could, could really see us all day long. <laughs> oh, my. It's like the Keystone Cops. Chinese yeah. fire drill around here. Yeah. <laughs> and as y'all can see, I'm not being real particular. I'm kind of missing. I'm not covering 100%. Well, she's got to leave some room for me. Yeah. See? And I'm going back in where I rubbed that off, and there's plenty there. Okay, switch. To me, stenciling is relaxing, don't you think? I do. I enjoy it. And you're gonna you're gonna uh, do a lot more stenciling later, aren't you? I am. Yeah. My focus this year is stencils. I'm going to try to become a expert stenciler. That's why I'm in Jennifer uh, Ferguson's group, mostly, is because I want to learn how to be a really good stenciler. Jennifer's really good. That's... She's written some books. So... In well, fact, whenever I first started... Uh, Info finishing. I think it was her book was the very first book I ever bought. Is that right? Yes. Well, I watched her do those grapes, and that was that was the ball game for me. I was hooked. I love those grapes she did. Uh huh. They were so pretty. Now all I got to do is try to figure out how to do that. Of course, she's had thirty years worth of experience, and I'm sixty years old. I don't have I don't have that much time. I gotta hurry up. <laughs> oh, you got thirty more years. What I, you I don't I don't think I'll be stenciling when I'm ninety. You might. Well, I might. It's hard to say. Yeah. April Bonham McKee said stenciling is her goal too. Is that right? Awesome. Well, you ought to come over and join Jennifer's group then. Y'all, I can't see who's on mine because my moderator's at the house. <laughs> well, I was checking yours a while ago for you. But then you, you know, I had to come to work. I had to get over here on my stencil brush. Are you right side up today? I she am, is. I am right side up, y'all. The other day I was sideways. Life just happens at the speed of life. Not a lot we can do about it. It's going to be lonely when I go home next week. It is. I'm already getting a little sad. I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> it's kind of like a breakup. Yeah. I gotta get up in here. Yes. Sir. Or have you already got? Have you already? I'm, got I'm done. Oh, I just I love these colors together. Well, it was my idea to put the sable on here. <laughs> it she, was. She picked the pink. Yes. And they do. They look pretty. They look pretty boss together. I think. Yes. Y'all need to really watch for these. Uh, 
Jennifer's really got some beautiful uh, stencils. She do, she do. And rollers. And uh, yeah, her decorative rollers. I love her decorative yes, rollers. Yes, me too. <clears throat> I'm gonna be on the uh, DIY retailer page um, Friday night. I'm gonna be using one of them decorative rollers, among other things. I'm gonna do a little. Scott said, "My absolute favorite is raisin stencils." I love raisin stencils too. I'm gonna be doing a raisin stencil on uh, the DIY retailer page Friday night. And y'all really need to watch that. It's Friday night. Y'all hear my dog over there? She apparently is having a nightmare. And she was snoring pretty Can good. Can you hear? This Friday night? Or? Yes, this Friday night is in two, night, two nights from tonight. Mm. My dog's asleep over this, here on this the sofa is the right collar. here. Is that not pretty? That's the bargain. Yeah, thing. Nancy, I brought my dog. She's asleep. Hey, Bonnie, how are you? I haven't seen um, you in a long time. I need some of my color. Do you? Mm -hmm. Just a tad. Just a tad? All right. There you go. Now you have it back. I don't want it. Now. Oh, you don't want it? I don't want it now. Okay. What? I've got to charge. Is your Bonnie Manning traveled all the way from Texas to my house to teach me how to do torn paper. Oh, my gosh. Yes. Wow. It's a beautiful family. Now that's a friend right there. Yes. It was. It's a long way from Texas to anywhere. Texas is just a big old place. She has hung a lot of wallpaper. <laughs> In her day? Yes, she has. All right, I'm not sure. I think that is beautiful. Is it? Maybe, maybe right. I think that's the last spot right there, Jane, and we, we're done. Gosh, we're getting done awful early. I know it. Well, we're not done yet. Let's pull this butt puppy off of here and see what we got. Okay. Then we'll know I'm whether gonna, we're done or not. I'm going to put that on there. And uh, whenever you are doing this, it's no big deal if you pull it off because you can lay it Because right it's taped down. down. So yeah. you, you always keep it anchored and then you can pick it up and see if it's going like you want it to. Oh. I think it yeah. went like we wanted it to, don't you? I do, I do. That is. That Keisha said with all your Facebook lives, she's never on Facebook. <laughs> is that not beautiful? Wow. That is absolutely gorgeous. I wonder why. Marilyn Dawson said, Rock right Pretty. Thank you. That would just make a beautiful powder bath finish. And seeing it wouldn't wouldn't take very long, easy to do, absolutely gorgeous. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> hey, hey, Donna and Bonnie. Uh, thank you. Thank you. It is pretty. I think it turned out pretty yes. too. So very pretty. Want to see it up close? Yeah. I did. Oh, you did the up close? Yeah. Okay. But they need a All double right. dose. Well, they probably just don't need a <laughs> double dose. Okay. It's really pretty. I, hey, we were having a class last night, so that's why I wasn't at um at y'all at um Hayesville last night, Bonnie and Donna. That's why. So I just don't hey, want Elaine. you to think I was laying out. I, I was teaching a class. Funny. All right. Anybody got any questions? Wowza. Wow. Wowza. Wowza. Yeah. Love, Love your crest. Thank you. Thank you. Tomorrow is going to be a fun day. Um, now we're 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 going to do something. We're going to blow your socks off tomorrow night. That's right. Well, I guess what time tomorrow is it? Is tomorrow. It four? Tomorrow at four. Not tomorrow night. We're going to blow your socks off with what we do tomorrow night. Tomorrow afternoon, four o'clock. We're going to have a spray gun, and we're going to do some ombre. And uh, the thing is, 
what we're going to do that ombre on. On, yes. It's going to. It's a surprise. It's a surprise. It's a surprise. Not me, is it? No, no, no we're not going to ombre you, <laughs> ombre. Hey, Kelly. Okay. All righty. Well, if y'all don't have any questions, then I'm going to say thank you so very much for yes. watching. Um, I always am grateful that you would stop what you're doing to um, come watch our lives. So yes. tomorrow will be a fun day. We got to fix a paint tent. It will be 23, but won't miss it. Oh my gosh, yeah, it'll be 11 o'clock at night, won't it? 2300 hours will be 11 o'clock at night. Okay, well, that would be great. We would love for you to join us. Okay, so peace. Right. Thank you so much. Bless With a grateful heart. And um, we'll see you tomorrow at 4. God bless y'all. Can you hit mine? I can. Thank you. Bye, y'all.